Hey everybody, Scott Sprinza here, DocSports.com. Welcome to our update for Sunday, February 23rd, 2020. Got a free pick in college baskets in just a moment. First quick note, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com and just want to give it a trial run, click on the link below the video, get yourself set up for a free $60 account, and then you can use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages over at DocSports.com. We're coming off a huge Saturday. We went seven and two. We told you last night we had nine plays, all sports covered basically uh, on Saturday we go seven and two and one hundred dollar per unit players picked up over twenty two hundred dollars so just spent a hundred dollars a unit was able to turn over two grand yesterday's card alone we went uh, two and one in college baskets we hit the six star play our top play in college baskets that was pepper nine plus the points uh, we go two and oh in the NBA we hit the game of the month with the Phoenix Suns we won the other game easily with the Brooklyn Nets uh, just right down the line, everything came in for us. We had another $1.50 underdog in the NHL, second night in a row with a $1.50 underdog last night. It was Arizona. They destroyed Tampa Bay 7-3. to three. We also swept our fight card. Man, we've just been red hot with our fight cards. We're now up over 23 units with our last four fight cards. We had Hooker in UFC. He won by split decision. And we had Tyson Fury, small underdog, getting the win for us over Deontay Wilder. I don't know if you got to see the, the fight itself. I did and boy it was just total domination start to finish until they stopped the fight in favor of uh, Tyson Fury so just a great day overall seven and two uh, we won a couple of the games here two and one uh, with our free picks we won the under in that football game between Seattle and Dallas we were also able to cash Oregon uh, our one loss with the free picks was the Dallas Mavericks but again great day overall yesterday we're going to look to continue to do well on Sunday uh, we'll look to finish up strong for this weekend and I've got uh, college basketball which will be posted at 11:30 a.m eastern time we've got a five-star play in college basketball my nba at 1 p.m eastern and i've got nhl on sunday and that will be available also at 1 p.m eastern just like the nba so go grab them all let's finish up strong seven and two on saturday let's make it three and oh on sunday and also nascar it's available right now i've got one matchup for nascar we won last week at daytona and by the way folks my nascar record now our run uh, 15 and four going back to last year with my last 19 races 22 Two and seven with our last 29, and we're up over $6,500 for $100 per unit players. If you're playing just 200 bucks per unit, you're up 13 grand just since about May of last year on this 22 and seven NASCAR run. And by the way, I am going to have a NASCAR video for Sunday. It'll be up uh, early, uh, overnight, Saturday night into Sunday, and we'll have a free matchup on uh, that report on the free NASCAR uh, report for Sunday. So be sure to check that out if you're into the NASCAR left turn circuit. All right, let's get to our free pick for Sunday. We're going to back Seton Hall, minus the points, land double digits over St. John's. Listen, St. John's just can't shoot on the road 38%. Uh, meanwhile, on the defensive end, they just allow way too many free throws like 29 free throws per game is what they allow when they're on the road they're always in foul trouble they've got a minus five rebound margin per game on the road Seton Hall comes in they've won 38 of the last 49 straight up at home against St. John's how about that they've won five straight at home against the Johnnies and listen that first matchup where Seton Hall had a scratch and claw to win 82 to 79 they were down by 13 at one point in the second half before they kicked it into gear Miles Powell got it going in the second half at a big final 20 minutes for the Pirates Pirates in that one. Uh, they're getting a little bit more action from some other players besides Miles Powell at this Miles Powell, excuse me, at this point. And I think this is a very important game that's not and that and the importance of it's not going to escape Seton Hall, their players, because they've got games coming up against Marquette, Villanova, Creighton, and so they need to win games that they're supposed to, and I think they'll be focused and ready to go. I mentioned how bad St. John's shooting is on the road. Well, how about Seton Hall at home? They only give up 38, I guess 38 and a half percent shooting at home and less than 28% is what they allow at home from the three-point line. We're going to back Seton Hall. Going to lay the points with the Pirates. Your free pick for Sunday. Go check out all my action on Sunday. We look to build on that 7-2 and two Saturday. And again, if you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Spritz at DocSports.com. Let's put Sunday in the win column. We're right back here Monday, 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific.